Yeah, I love Patapon. <laughs> nope. I still, whenever I travel, I have, um, yeah, whenever I travel, I still have a, a Vita that I use that has Patapon 3 on it. I just, I play that so much. Yeah, I, um, I have the, the kind of remasters they did, but because of how, like, they never added a way to adjust for audio delay. So it's really touchy, really touchy to, uh, to play those. It's a bummer because I would love to be able to play the Patapon 1 and 2 re yeah, like they look beautiful, but without them adding any way to adjust like delays up or down, it's I was able to do it, but it just didn't feel great. And that sucks. It's, it's supposed to feel good. <laughs> it just doesn't. Yep. Mm hmm. And I can stay in fever like for an entire level in three when I have the headphones plugged in and it's just made for that system. It's a bummer. I wished more. Oh, actually, if you know Patapon, do you know about the uh, the other game being made by the devs who made the original? Because while PlayStation owns the right to Patapon itself, all a lot of the devs. Oh, you got to check out Ratatan. It's. It was kickstarted. It made a ridiculous amount of money. Yep, it'll be on Switch. I think it's gonna be on everything. They they cleared PC and um, all the consoles. So it's also gonna be Let's nice. Go. It's gonna have multiplayer, which I never got to really do much of in the. Um, handheld versions i never had a decent way to play multiplayer on vita or the psp i'm really interested into what that's going to be like as i said i'm playing a lot of pat upon three now and you can do the multiplayer with bots but they're really bad bots are really bad these will do nicely straight out no, no. Hope this thing likes uh, roasted Ibex meat. Yeah, we, we got him. <laughs> Easy. Look at that. Easy thousand experience. Love to see it. 16 hides. Got it. Connect Captain Crunch, welcome in. Return to the sea and to the clouds rise again. Well, doing about to go take down a big beast. Start. We have our bait then. What next? Next, we, we pay a visit we to the dark trap, gate to pick some local weed. It'll help disguise our scent. We got that loco weed on 420. All right, Ambrosia, let's roll. I'm gonna mosey slowly. Bro. I'm trying to figure out why this. Oh, just kidding, because so I have to get off of it. Be safe. I should have been be able to have Ambrosia do. Just kick open the door for me. You're a big bird. Oh, David, do you think this is my first day streaming? Let me how often has that actually worked for you, bud? Is, I will give you credit. That's the first time I've seen that one. I haven't seen that specific message. So, points for originality. <laughs> and bye. 
I will say I am surprised that they mentioned something. Usually they just try and drop the their bait message and just bounce. <laughs> cool. Okay. Well, now that that's now that that's done. That is the funniest part of, of local shorts and, and TikTok streaming. Here. Look for the golden leaves. In these giant ones right here. Also, thank you, Frank. Is this it? Aye, that's the stuff. Yep, I fixed it. Push the leaves between your fingertips and rub them on your clothes. Uh, if you insist. Not the weirdest thing we've been covered in live. You could have warned me about the smell. <laughs> like corruption, isn't it? What? We'll have an honor guard of flies before long. But I mean, the number the of monster guts and stuff he's its been covered nose in. will tell it we're nothing but a feast for worms. Oh, I feel so much better. We can wash it <laughs> off afterwards. If there's one good thing about the Giver choosing the ruins Giver, for its it hunting ground, it's it that there's plenty of fresh water nearby. All right, so where is this thing's hunting ground? Oh, is that at the temple? Yeah, which is good, because it means I can just warp to here and run backwards. Yeah, where should we lay the bait? Safe. Gavers are creatures of habit. Look for some sign of its passing. It's sure to return to the same place sooner or later. Yeah. Oh, the coral's gone. Better. You deserve a rest. You inspect the one that's already half eaten here. A fresh kill. But not a Givrus. The wounds are too clean. Too small. Coral? Why did I not pick up that item? I ran right over it. These look like a predator's tracks. You can clearly make out the claws. Is it a predator, though? And not just any claws. Oh, okay. These belong it is. to a Givra. There's no mistake in them. We'll lay the bait here. Let's hope our friend is hungry. Nice chopped up Ibex. I'm sure that's not suspicious at all. Still no sign. Patience, Clive. Hunting's not something you can rush. Have you stalked these beasts before? Once. Gavers are fast, so the job called for a bearer. But even with my knack, it was a close-run thing. Not many leaders would take such risks for their people. Yeah, she didn't the man say what who they battled need. an icon to save a boy he barely knew. It is the way of the Mots of Water to use what gifts we've been given for the good of all. And I gather it's your way, too. It was Sit, the man whose name I bear. He fought for his people and their future with every fiber of his being. And I'm just following in his footsteps. In many ways, you remind me of him. Me? You're confusing Darren. With desperation. Quiet. There's our beast. Something's coming. Oh, it's a big dragon. All right. Not what I was our expecting. Guest it to has be. finally arrived. Shall we greet him? Oh, I didn't set the It'd powers. Oh no! Don't no. no, no, start to fight yet. Don't start to fight yet. Damn it. 
Well, no ultimate powers for me. Don't let it escape. Oh, Togo came with us. Let's try. Thanks, lady. Just took that hit for me. Get punched, idiot. the circle to show up and then punch him in the face. I go back to town, I'm gonna go set Ultima's ability. That way I don't forget again. You weren't exaggerating when you said they were dangerous. They're forces of nature, all right. And with this one's passing, the river of life has calmed. Now time for its tongue. O roaring torrent, son of storms, may your spirit run free in the open ocean. This flesh I claim, that your gifts might rain down upon us this day, and our river flow in spate once more. Oh, the sounds. Well then, let's return to the village. We must get this tongue to Yamilla before it spoils.
first. Ever. Huh. Expensive too. Oh, that's crazy looking. What the hell? Look at that too. Why not? Wait, that's not master. Oh, yeah, right. That's not master to me. Master that first. All right. Well, I actually set any of those. This one, and I want to try Voice of God. I want to see what that looks like. Oh, you become the pillar of light. Okay, cool. That's wild. Wow. Lady Milla? Tributary, my lord, did all proceed as planned? It did, here. Yeah. One giver tongue, as promised. Giver tongue. Get this thing out of my inventory. Oh, thank you. I shall add it to the broth at once. Will it help? By your leave, tributary. If there is anything else that we can do to help, you need only ask. Oh, no, no. You've already done more for my family than I can ever repay. Just as you have, Clive, for my family. I only regret that I have nothing to offer you in return but my gratitude. It's more than enough. Besides, I'm no less grateful to you. I have some wild ass powers now, thanks. <laughs> For welcoming my friends and I into your midst. For showing us how your people live. For reminding me that the world we strive to create, where bearers can live alongside their fellow men in peace and comfort, is no mere fantasy. I'd hardly call it comfort. Every day is a struggle. Though we do at least struggle together, it's true. As must we all. I only ask that you remember the cost of using your gifts as a bearer. I know that you feel it's your duty to do whatever you can to help your people. Yeah, stop casting magic. You have a child to think about now. And Wallace has lost enough. I shall bear that in mind. That's all I ask. Oh, and if there is anything else that we can do to help, well, you know. Thank you. Truly. Holy shuttle, this is Final Fantasy 16. There are only a couple more quests in here. Just as a heads up, this is towards the end of the game, so I do not want anyone to get spoiled without knowing it. It is good to have them back. Oh, Shula's down here now. Okay, hello again, Shula. No, it has to be him. What has to be who? That's fine. Okay. You, uh, hey, thanks for the follow. Don't mind my asking. It's not your asking, I mind. It's my explaining. But I don't see any other way around it. You see, when a baby is born here, we hold a ceremony to welcome them. The rite of immersion, we call it. 
but I don't know whether Wallius was ever afforded that courtesy. What is abundantly clear, though, is that my ancestors never welcomed him as one of us. Have it now. And I want to change that. The problem is, the ceremony requires three ministrators. The baby's parents and a witness. As tributary, the role of witness would normally fall to me. But being Wallace's closest living relative, I must play the role of mother. So you want me to serve as witness in your stead? That's right. A witness Services. must be a trusty guardian, ready to steer the child through the Welcome stormy Jackie. waters of life and on to tranquility. Which is why I thought of you. No, I think it was that they even needed a witness. Also, I've always had that same problem, especially in games like this, because there'll be so many little enemies. But when it's just the boss, you have one thing to focus on. I would get wrecked by just a squad of little enemies and then just go deathless on a boss like first try. It happened to me constantly when I was playing the story. It would be my honor. Thank you, Clive. So, if you will serve as mother and I as mm -hmm. witness, who will take on the father's role? Joshua, it'd be funny. I have a younger brother. Uh -huh. He should be making ready for the rite as we speak, though whether he is or not. <sighs> Let me introduce you. You know, he Please does do. have that sort of girlfriend that you just never run, see sure again. We'll get on famously. I'll bid him come to the Witten Hall. Will you wait for us there? Gladly. Hey, remember her name. The water of 10k for this quest. There's going to have to be something else to it besides what? Ooh, Benedict the hit list. That, oh. Oof. Just remember the bits of that fight that I do remember. God. Clive, my brother. If it isn't my old mate, Sid. You. Oh, so this is the do bandit guy. So you remember me, even stripped of my cunning disguise. <laughs> I'm touched. You two know each other. My friends and I cross paths with your brother yeah. on our hunt okay. for the dusk crystals. That's why you had to do the, this, the old DLC before life. you do this one. Okay. Three times, was it? <laughs> Three, four. Who's counting? All I know is when Shula mentioned she'd called in Sid the Outlaw to help young Walias. I could be sure that the little rascal was in safe hands. I mean, having seen you in action back at the tower, I know exactly what you're capable of. I need him. So the mercenary you met in the Sage Spire, that was Clive. <laughs> and he saved your life. That's a rather different story from the one you told me. <laughs> and a far likelier one at that. It would appear my family owe you twice over whether they admit it or not. Honestly, Fammy, would it kill you to tell the truth once in a while? What? It almost did a few I times. Sorry, didn't I? <laughs> How about we save the uh, recriminations until after the ceremony, eh? Speaking of which, what does this ceremony involve exactly? Yeah, they've been really not mentioning this. It's simple, Honey, really. We each say a short prayer and anoint the child's head with holy water. Oh, it's a baptism. Nothing too onerous then. Except the monster. Not about the rite itself. No. Yeah, here we go. Of course. But it does call for some preparation. <laughs> One of the witnesses' responsibilities is to collect the holy water, you see. Three files for the three ministrators, each taken from a particular place. Don't worry, though. It's not as if you have to go alone. I can show you the way. I'd appreciate that. Hmm. Famiel, you stay here and ready the Witten Hall. <laughs> Leave yeah. it to me. I don't trust this if guy, though. there's anything Jill and I can do to assist you, we'd be glad to help. Thank you both. Oh, yeah, something like Titan Lost, too. She's kind of like keeps appearing off the walls and shit. Oh, oof. All right, then. Let's get started, shall we? Oh, yeah, getting to the end. Water that we must first. collect. 
the water of the mountain, of the river, and of the sea. I knew this sounded too we easy at first. the water first. of the mountain from the spring atop Maiden's March. The water of the river from the course that flows through the ruins of Rivers Meet. And the water of the sea from the shallows of Tailwind Bay. Here are the files we'll be using in the ceremony. I'm ready to leave whenever you are. They're not going to be near any, like, teleport spots, are they? Oh, that one's not far. I haven't gone that way. Alright, they're actually not that far from fast travel. That's not too bad. So means it's just the pain. Oh, right. I forgot you don't get that right away. Ready, go. The more you talk about that, the Run more that the sounds like a, a hell of a challenge to do. So are you on like the regular difficulty or are you doing it on Final Fantasy book? Well, I guess it wouldn't technically we matter. I guess it would just have more health. All right. Final Fantasy. Ouch. So wait, we never came down here, I don't think. I remember this nation. <laughs> I've done I've done challenges like that before. Um the water of the river represents life. It is constantly moving, constantly changing. And though its course may twist and turn or branch into a thousand separate streams, it always flows in the same direction from source to sea, beginning to end. Like time. What of Wallius then? Oh, you. When your ancestors froze him, did they remove him from the river of life? They did. Like an ice-bound pool that didn't thaw for 80 summers. But now he's free to flow again, to live. And you and I shall flow with him, for we are all but drops of water in the great river of life. I find that thought oddly reassuring. Go on. A drop of water might seem insignificant on its own, but as a part of a torrent, it can cleave a path through the hardest rock. It makes me believe we humans might just stand a chance. I believe we might. Take care not to spill it. Yeah. Right. Let's save that for the ceremony. I, um... I... Think problem. There. So if it's another M. Son of. Oh yeah, no, I definitely think that would be a terrible idea to do that on the first run. I have done. I haven't done hit list, but I've definitely done um, just for my own misery, I guess. In Blasphemous Two, I was attempting a no upgrades run, which was rough. I know I've done other like challenges and I'm trying to think of what they Ready were. Ready go? I never really kept like a record of them. It was just like, I wonder if I can do this. Oh, I did um, Elden Ring using only shields. That's probably the longest uh, dumb challenge I've done in a game. really wish that I had been like recording locally when I did that because I don't have any video of that anymore and it sucks. Ah, what? I'm warning you. With the brother. Someone's in trouble. Yeah. Come on. How did that work out? We, we did it. Like I, I made it. 
You can you can beat Elden Ring using only shields. It turns out. Help! Help! What help? Nobody's coming to help. We're here to help. Keep its attention on us. Most of the time, I would agree with you. I don't know what it was about that one specifically, but I just felt like it was something I could actually pull off. Too slow. And it was also to see, because I couldn't, I didn't know if anyone, if it could be done. I think other people have tried it since. Like, I had known somebody had done a uh, bow on I've seen like hand-to-hand -hand combat. But those are still like weapons. about this cat. This is oh, ow. Yeah, I probably should have paid attention to what that button was popping up for, huh? Yeah. You can just chain those counters together too, huh? Oh, thanks, buddy. Appreciate nice boy. That's like a long time to charge up. And it gets cancelled very easily. To me, boy. Well done, Togo. Too slow. Shit. Too slow. Hey, you know what? It's in the game. It still counts. It's not like you modded it. When I did my uh, the shield run, I would sometimes use mimic, but I only used the um, not mimic. I used the summons, but it was the group of shield enemies. So I was still just essentially doing the same thing. It's absurdly curious when you playing a game Love it. yeah especially when it comes to like souls games like that you get some people who are very particular about what nice they have try. decided counts as like clearing or doing certain things over here you claim that like summoning your friends in doesn't count either it's like yeah but it also increases the health of enemies and stuff so it's not necessarily that much easier 
especially in the non Elden Ring Souls, where you could just get invaded at any time. I hate invasions. So having extra people was always fun to deal with invaders. Is anyone hurt? Oh, Sid! Thank all the clouds in the heavens you came. <laughs> you saved us. Again. Those jackets Would seem you two care really to heavy for this what climate. We're doing up here? The chief sent us to fetch incense for the ceremony. So the Witten Hall smells nice. Uh for the little Ben. Yeah. <clears throat> you mean uh -huh. to tell me you braved this den of deadly beasts for some tree sap? You don't have to do everything he says, you know. Or if you must, at least have the good sense to ask one of our hunters to accompany you. We're sorry. <sighs> it's fine. Just go back to the village before you get yourselves into any more trouble. <laughs> well, you are. Oh, and uh, thanks and that. Remind me to give my brother a cuff round the ear when we get back. <laughs> Her brother's a menace. Right then. Yeah, the water. Let's collect this water, shall we? Keep you in entertainment. There you go. The rain that falls on the mountain emerges here in these springs. The source of the river. The source of life. Precisely. Just one more file to go then. Nearly done. Much less detailed description on that one. So I guess we go from Hellwind and then you can walk. That looks like the path. Cardle <whistles> has a. You know, yeah, I want to see what this guy has. I know there's some materials I'm still missing, so. This won't be easy, Clive. He will be. We'll just block the turtle. Oh, that's fine. Be set. Oh, oh, I can count. I carry it back. That's right. I forgot about that. The, the thing about the invasions in those games is that it's such a particular skill set to know how to deal with the input lag of those games, and I can just never figure it out. Because of that, I just get murked constantly. I hate it. Oh, I can't count it down. Especially considering my first character in Elden Ring, I was a um, faith and dragon caster. And faith spells are not very good in the beginning. So I was just getting destroyed if I was trying to fight something on my own. At one point we got invaded and I just hid in a bush and I let my friends fight them because they just kept getting really mad that they couldn't find me. I should pay attention to what I got from the turtle. Too busy looking at flying around. Let's go. Just go. So that run like the wind. Uh, 
grab this without aggro. Wolves, there we go. One of the things I love, it was in um, Dark Souls 2. There was an item you could have. So you obviously know normally when invaders come in, the enemies don't attack them. There was an item you could get that it would make invaders become aggroable to random enemies. It was my favorite thing to do to just have an invader think they were safe and then this just everything turns the on. Usually we keep this gate shut tight, but since this is a special occasion, there's gonna be an end there. You deserve a rest. Why is this normally kept clear? Thank the tides, the weather held. This place can be treacherous when the waves are high. If it weren't for the holy water, no one would ever come down here. I'll be sure to watch my step. Hi, Mika. How's your weekend been? Water flows to the sea, then rises into the clouds. Just like life, Cycle. the end is not the end, only a new beginning. Circle of life. My ancestors chose this place because it was where the first boat landed. And it's a good thing they didn't that land like closer to the surge. A convenient spot for a Quite. fight down here. Oh shit! Oh, okay. I thought he was gonna take fall damage for some reason. Oh, maybe there's not enough. It's like a terrible place to land a boat. The water of the sea. I still can't help but be awed by it. Oh? All that wave ever made me feel was pity and sorrow for the innocent life trapped inside it. Yeah. The child my great-grandfather sacrificed to try to change his people's fate. It was wrong. An unforgivable sin. But I often wonder, will my descendants ever forgive me for what I have done? As tributary, I've faced many difficult choices. And though I've always striven to do what's best for my people, here we live in poverty, hidden away from the world. So have my choices denied them a better life, just as my ancestors denied Walius his. No. You would not forcibly sacrifice one of your people to save the others. You do the best you can for all of them, as do I. We share in their woes, just as we share in their joys. And the most we can do is try to bring them more of the latter. Aye, you're right. And try I shall to bring all of my people a better tomorrow. Walius included. <laughs> then I wish you luck. If my time with the boy is any indication, <laughs> he's going to be quite a handful. <laughs> hmm. Then we must start as we mean to go on and give him the very best welcome we can. Where to next then? Back to the village yeah. to find out if my brother has made the necessary preparations. Sent them off to oh, God, death again. To do it for him. We have the holy water. Is everything else in place? All ready to go. Told you you could count on me. Then let us begin. Famiel, have your men summon everyone to the Witten Hall. Right you are. 
This guy in his trunks looking ass. Should have wait. I don't know the words. Don't worry. There aren't many of them. We'll have time enough to practice before people arrive. I can't tell if that's like me or if that's on him because he is was a dumb one. My friends, we are gathered here today to welcome this child into our community by the right of immersion, as has been our custom since the first reign. As tributary, I would normally perform the rite with the child's parents. But Walius's mother and father returned to the sea long ago. So I and my brother Famiel shall serve as his family, while the one who returned him to us shall bear witness in my stead. Clive, if you would step forward. We take off the sword for this. Feels like a sword free activity, but maybe that's just me. Like the rain that falls on the mountains tall, are we born? <laughs> like the river that flows through the valleys below. Do we live? Dropping water on a baby. <laughs> like the boundless sea, where the currents run free, do we die? And do the clouds then rise again? The circle of water is the circle of life, and today, from the heavens, falls rain anew. This child, Walius, now joins our stream, and he shall flow with us from the mountains to the sea. <sighs> Seems you played so your small. part to a T, Clive. Thank you. It means a lot to us. I was honored to be asked. And terrified I'd miss. <laughs> now that you're part of the family, young Walias, my lad. Uncle Samuel can teach you the ways of the world. <laughs> oh, no, he can't. <laughs> eh? Don't be so hasty. Your brother's knack for self-preservation might serve him well. Ha! You are never going to let me live that down, are you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to raise Walius as if he were my own. Teach him everything I know about life, our people, and our past. But with all the mother crystals gone, he will grow up in a world without comforts. One where we only have ourselves and each other to rely on. 
I'd say your people are better prepared than most to survive in such a world, Shula. To thrive, indeed, under your guidance. Only if nature continues to smile on us. If we were to lose her gifts, we'd be left with nothing at all. Yes. But it needn't come to that. Not if we can stop the spread of the blight. So long as we can save a single patch of soil, we can plant the seeds for a new world. One where we can all be free. Perhaps then, we might finally be able to step out from behind our curtain, eh? Till that day comes, I wish you good tide. Thank you. We should be on our way. Well, you be careful out there. Aye, you steer clear of trouble now. <laughs> <laughs> Likewise. And it seems like to be ten alias uh <laughs> no. Make a run on the end? I don't remember how long the whole end sequence takes. think we must be the first outsiders to have witnessed that right in over a century Wallius has been waiting for it for nearly as long <sighs> he seemed pleased to be finally rejoining the family now all we have to do is save that family to change our river's course yeah that didn't change anything it seemed like there's just a couple of lines in the fight itself that's that seems weird but at least the DLC was good. The Leviathan fight was very good. But it is uh two thirty, so we're gonna we're gonna wrap this up here. Thank you all for hanging out. That's been uh so yeah, so it won't be a stream tomorrow then, because apparently they really overestimated on the ten hours then, huh? Cause even then I went through the whole ending again, which I think took about an hour and a half. And there were only two quests left in the new town, so hey. I like it though. Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.